Okay, so I'm going to take a look at how the scissor tool works in Illustrator CS5. All right, so what we begin with is we can start with the shape tool. And we look at our shape tools, we come, we tear our shape tools off. And we can start with just a regular square. I'm going to change the fill color of this um, so it stands out a little bit more. And the way that your scissors work is we come in and we can see that your scissors are in the same box where the eraser is. Okay, so we have the eraser, the scissor, and the knife tool. Now, Illustrator is very much based on anchors and paths. And what this is, it's a vector drawing program which is based on mathematical equations. So underlying the paths and the anchors are mathematical equations. When we go to cut, we can only cut on a path. Okay, so as I hover here, you can see that I get this word path. I could click right here. I could come down below. I could click right here. Now I've made two cuts. Now what I can do is I can come over and actually I'm going to take my, you can see how I have these two separated now. I can move this away. Hold on for a minute. I'm going to take my white arrow. I'm going to click this side and move it. Now, the difference between the white arrow and the black arrow, I'm going to put this back for a minute. Okay. If I was to select my selection tool, um, a lot of times it selects the whole thing. This time it's not. But your selection tool often will select the whole object. The direct select tool will select that one part. So we could delete that one part and then there we have it. So again, the way that the scissor tool works, I'm going to make an arc, is it cuts along a path. So again, we come in, we take the scissor, I can come to watch if I'm not on a path and I click, I get this message that says that you need to use it on a segment or an anchor point, uh, not on an end point of a path. So come back in click. Now let's take a look. If I take my black arrow, um, I can move these both. I've cut this. So your scissors, again, um, very much are just on a path. I'll look at one more thing with these scissors. Delete, delete. Now if I was to come in with my shape tool and draw this shape, um, and I came and grabbed my scissors. If I was to cut in the center, it doesn't work. Again, it needs to be on the path um, and or on even on one of the points. You can cut it directly at an anchor point. So there we have it, the scissors.